Hello. Glad to see you here today. My name is Nate. I'm your host today. I'm coming to you from near or far. So grab a chair, kick back, and enjoy. As you've seen in my v uh, description, I am here at one of the cemeteries I wanted to come to for a long time. It's uh, Southport Cemetery. I'll show you. Uh, that's it right there. I'm not going to mess with some of the newer graves. Cause, um, I want to find the oldest ones in here. So uh, come along with me today. And here's an 1898 to 1902, Miss Gussie Morgan. And here's an 1877 to 1937, Captain John L. Price, Master Mariner. Hmm. He was a, a captain of a ship. His uh, 1848 to 1924, 1848 to 1937, John E. Price and Mary Price. And here's 1838 to 1913, J.L. Bell. And here's a um, 1864 to 1930, and 1871 to 1954. And here's Mr. Frederick Thomas Burgess, 1869 to 1938. And there's a 1845 to 1961. Here's the 1893 to 1902. And 1842 to 1915. Oh, I think that's the oldest one I found so far. 1833 to 1896. And here's a crypt. Joseph R. Kermit, Kermit, 1829. This is the oldest. And he was born in Ireland, but it don't really give a death now this one right here might be one of the oldest ones I hear really don't have anything on the tombstone itself but these bricks kind of give it away and here's a 1791 I found the oldest 1791 to 1855 Sterling Everett. Now I've been told by the nice people here is working at the graveyard that this one is the oldest. But you can't read any other writings on it. But he's, he was telling me the guy that's cutting the grass here, he told me it is the oldest. And like it was in the military too. This is amazing. This crypt is here between these two big old huge trees. Now, like it's about to cave in, I guarantee you it's been fell in. But, 1800 to 1825, he was 25 years old.
thought I would just do this one. It's not that old, but it's a pretty cool uh, headstone. But it is, well, one of them is 1843 to 1915. Well, I guess it is 1844 to 1913. 60 years, 21 days, 30, 20, 21 months, or 36, 60 years, 2 months, and 30 days. And here's the 1847 to 1920. 1858 to 1920. Ida Matson and David W. Matson. And here's Lewis James Pepper, 1850 to 1919. Looks like he was a, a mariner. And here's 1853 to 1914. Now these are pretty cool right here. These don't have really... I really can't tell what that writing is down there on the bottom. Oh, 1793 to 1851. And here's uh, Kate Stewart, 1844 to 1929. And here's one of those that I don't like. 1844, 89 years old. I don't like those. Here's Miss Elizabeth Warren, 1827 to 1900. You probably can't, I know you probably can't read this, but it's the Father Christopher Morse, 1829 to 1903, or 1903, Mother Virginia Morse, 1832 to 1903. And it says they were lighthouse service, U.S. lighthouse service. And here's 1840 to 1903, and I can't read the name. 1838 to 1898, 30 years old, no. Oh. Sixty years old, sorry. And I can't really read that one. And here's eighteen ninety two to nineteen hundred. Eighteen ninety three to nineteen sixty. Eighteen seventy six to nineteen sixty six. Eighteen seventy two to nineteen fifty. 1857 to 1934 and 1857 to 1939 here's Rebecca Drew 1890 but they don't give her date uh, birth date oh my goodness oh that scared me I didn't know what that was there's 1815, 1885, and 1859 to 1882. And here's the 1879 to 1937. This is John Hopper. This is quite amazing. You can tell this tree is back in the 1800s. Because some of these graves are here are 1848 to 1903. And this tree wasn't here. It had, you know, at least early 1800s. I mean, look at this, this one right here. The tree is completely taken over the grave, almost. And here's the 1848 to 1886. I can't pronounce the name because I can't see it. And in eighteen fifty-four to nineteen oh nine. 
And I think that's going to do it for this one. We walked around the Southport graveyard. Found some pretty old graves. We found some uh, military. I, I did take a lot of pictures of the military. So they will be at the very end of this video. I'll, sh I'll pay tribute to all the military. So that's going to do it. Be safe. God bless. And I'm out.